Hey guys, so thanks so much for coming back to my channel today. I want to share with you something a little different, but it's still not different because I did this with Catrell. So JJ is going to, on a two-day trip to Washington, D.C., and I am excited for him. A little worried, making sure that they get there safely and everything goes as planned. And so he's going on a two-day trip. The eighth graders are going... And they're going to some of everywhere. The Smithsonian, the White House, all the different um, things to do in D.C. So, I'm not necessarily going to show what is in his bag here. But, I am going to show what's in his other bag that he will take. And I think it's neat how everything just matches. And it's not even from the same area. But, of course, it's both Adidas. So, his bag here is from Shoe Show. And I think I got this. No, 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 no. The other bags from Shisho. This is from Marshalls. And Cottrell had a bag. So I wanted him to have a bag. And it was a great price at the time. You want that? It was like $12. Or did you want it? Oh. They over here trying to get my strawberry lemonade from Wendy's. Y'all know that that stuff is good. JJ was sneaking in here to get it. And he drunk about most of it. And it's wore it down. But Josiah wants it. Okay, so the bag is from Marshalls. It was a really good price, so check out their store. It's not the largest bag, but it carries a whole lot in here. So what JJ has in here, so I always like to overpack. And I think to make sure that you're prepared. So what he has in here, he has three pairs of pants and long sleeve shirts. He has four t-shirts in case he gets hot or he gets wet. Um perspiring or sweating or it gets wet for some reason and he has four pairs of underwear you should always have plenty of undergarments and he has three socks but I always like to over prepare with those two because you can step in water um, of course you don't want to walk barefooted on the hotel floor or anything like that and your feet your shoes or not your shoes but your socks may get really nasty so he has three but he really needs four. Um, that's just a long predicament with boys and I was just trying to find some stuff. So I'm going to have to order him. I know JJ some, Josiah some socks. And if you guys, I'm sure you know your kids and socks, how they are. And how all of the boys, they seem like their socks, they have the same size. And they get them all mixed up. And it's hard to tell whose is who. So we try to get different colors and different patterns. But anyway, he also has in here some shower shoes. I told him to be really careful because they can be slippery. And if he feels like he needs them, he should use them. Um, he should use them anyway. And then he also has like his slides in here. I think they're Nike. So if he doesn't want to walk barefooted on the hotel floor. And then he has two pairs of pajamas. So he does have like lounge like pajamas with you know, usually pajamas have like crazy characters or his have bananas on them. And I know he's rowing with three other boys. So I told him, well, Ashley Jason said, well, Hope, he may want to just have shorts. So I was like, okay, gym shorts. So he has two pairs of gym shorts and two pairs of just graphic tees. So I put his t-shirts on top, his underwear are under here, and then all of his pajamas, PJs, which he will grab first, are over here on the side. And all of this fit in this bag. And then here he has his shoes, uh, shower shoes, and his slides in here in this bag. So I told him to make sure you put your stuff together and don't have it all over the place where it gets mixed up with the other boys. And then I'm also going to write his name somewhere on this bag. So he had this bag for a while. It just looks brand new because he never hardly uses it. And it's too big to take for gym class. So usually for gym class, they take those drawstring bags. And I'm filming on the other half of my craft desk. And one day I'll give you guys a tour of my craft desk. But I'm still working on it. But um, it's a little different setup. So what inspired me to do this video is because I just did the Dollar Tree video and I show these packets these travel sets and they really are probably meant for white not white wet garments so for traveling and I was like you know what you don't have to just use that for 
wet garments you can use it for other items too so let me show you what I told him to put in here this bag came from shoeshow.com let's see if I can zoom out here so you guys can see and it's a sling bag and I forgot he had this bag he got it last Christmas and they may still have this I think I got trail a black and white one and I got one for my niece they had them for girls too I think in two different colors but they end up canceling hers because they didn't have it so I hated that but they did really didn't cost that much and they have a zipper here and shoeshow.com is of course online but shoe show they they have more stuff online than in the store and then it has like a pocket in here where he can put his phone and stuff and then another zip pocket here and the side pockets here and it has a cushiony strap on the back and I just thought that his other bag is really ratty so I told him I said well for Christmas I'll get you and control another drawstring bag to take with you but this bag is really light and they did tell them not to bring so much stuff because they have to go through the metal detectors and stuff but what I told him hopefully he was listening is to take this toiletry bag or his essentials bag out of his book bag and put it on top of his bag in his hotel room and then also his snack bag he has probably too many Swiss rolls I end up putting them all in there y'all so if you see my Dollar Tree haul you know what I'm talking about because it's only really four but it's they count each one so it's eight so they're gonna eat good they're, they said that in their information packet that they're going to eat good. They're going to eat like at a buffet or something. Um, they're going to give them vouchers, but they're going to eat at the hotel. I know for breakfast. So anyway, I'll show that in one second. So I told him to take these two out if he wants a snack to put the snack in here. And I tell you, you have to be really specific with your kids. And I don't know if girls are like this too, but I know where boys are. And with this other one, um, he's going to put all his electronic stuff in here. So he doesn't necessarily have to put his phone in here. But what is in here, make sure you guys can see, is I gave him my headphones. Because these were kind of, I can tell it has a little short. So I'm going to go ahead and get me some more. He has his battery pack here. And I got this one from Five Below. So we haven't used it a whole lot to tell the quality of it, but I guess he will certainly let me know. So I recently, when I upgraded my phone, JJ needed a phone really bad. Control gave him like his old iPhone and some kids, I think it was like a five, I don't even know. It was old because it was a smaller screen, way smaller screen. Some kids, I think at gym, stepped on his phone so it was cracked really bad and then he broke his headphones off in it so then the only way you could communicate to JJ was through text and he had to actually be looking at his phone so he needed a phone really bad so now he does have one I don't remember the name of his but his was only forty dollars and it's really a nice phone um, with Cricut and I did share that I think on my Instagram where you can get four lines of unlimited four hundred dollars and that's been a lifesaver for us. I will make sure I put a referral code down below. I didn't even was going to even talk about this, but I guess I was getting ready to mention how he has well, I will tell him to make sure he downloads the app. It's called Duo. So if you have an Android phone, we are an iPhone house. Half of us have iPhones. I still carry my other iPhone, do a lot of my Instagram pictures and stuff, but um it doesn't have a lot of data on a lot of space. So, loving my Android phone, and it has an app on it that you can download called Duo, and I did not know anything about it. My mom told me about it, and it's just like FaceTime. The quality is not the best, but it's FaceTime. Even if that person does not have Duo on their phone, then they, they will still get a notification or it will still ring and you can answer answer it it's just that they'll be like what in the world is going on because my mother-in-law did me like that one day and my mom did me too and then I answered but I didn't even know anything about it so it's called I think it's Google Google duo or duo duo 
so we love that because we used to spend so much money on cell phone service that I mean we were like mad paying the bill it was just ridiculous okay so in this bag these bags come from Dollar Tree you get one big one for a dollar and these two little ones for a dollar so I may go back and get some more because these are nice especially if we go somewhere so I told JJ to put his glasses in here he has two pairs that's another great place to go to guys is America's Best if you have one you get two pairs for I don't know what the deal is right now but usually two pairs my husband just lost his brand new pairs and he didn't go with us when we got ours and now I have to make him an appointment to get some glasses JJ's 13 he's been hard-headed these look brand new because he's not wearing them and I told him he needs to wear them because his eyes are just like his dad's and if he doesn't wear them they probably it's probably gonna get worse okay so he has two bags in here plastic Dollar Tree bags for any wet soiled dirty clothes and I told him to make sure that when he takes his clothes off to put them um, in the bag just tie it once either put it on the side of his bag his big bag or on top of his bag you don't have to put it in there till he's going home because he don't want to get his other clothes um, funky <laughs> so I was going to get him a travel size my Dollar Tree, the stuff was sitting there for like months, even through the summer. And when I went back yesterday, they had no travel deodorant. So I said, you know what? It's just two days. Um, he's not going to pack a whole lot of stuff. So he'll be fine with the degree. Take the full size. And then I was just in Dollar General. If I would have known, I would have got him some more fragrance-free lotion. Um, this didn't cost too much. He's almost gone. And JJ has eczema. You guys, I'm sure you know because I done said it so many times. So he used fragrance free lotion. Um, he had a soap saver. I hauled this. He probably needs Dove. Well, this is Dove, but he probably needs the plane. But I got this for him to see how it goes for him. He, I got him, I gave him Cottrell soap saver. He misplaced it from going upstairs to downstairs. I saw it in his hand. He doesn't know where it is, guys. So maybe we'll find it. I put some pre uh, pre 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 L wipes, hand sanitizer wipes, and his toothbrush, some mouthwash, and his um, eczema cream. This is like a steroid cream when it gets really. It seems like it's thick on a little bit or crusty, and so this is what this is for. Um, you guys may be familiar with that if you have eczema really bad. So over here where I haven't put in his bag, sometimes JJ will just have an outburst of sneeze. Just like he will just sneeze and it's just coming out. <laughs> so I'm putting some tissue in his bag, two of these. And this is the first time I opened them up. So I didn't realize they were so short. But he definitely needs this. And chapstick, he always needs some chapstick. So he has this. I'm going to give him some hand sanitizer. I'm glad I had a green one because I had purple. He might have been fine and not care what his friends say. But again, he's in the eighth grade. And then um, in this little, I need to wipe this off. In this little peel thing, um, he has two allergy peels. So he has Allegra and Allegra doesn't... Um, make you drowsy or anything like that so he has two of these in the last 24 hours it's actually walmart's brand um equate so i told him if he thinks he needs it usually he's clearing his throat and it's like super loud so we have to tell him go get some allergy medicine and he did an allergy test and jj is just about allergic to everything <laughs> so and i think all throughout the entire seasons so he has to um he has a prescription but he takes Allegra and he's just fine. So the Dow, I just have a little bit here. And he may use it, he may not. The body wash, I thought I had more, but I must have been using it. So I just love when you have extra stuff laying around the house from Dollar Tree and you don't really need it. And I was really trying to think, what all does he need? So let me put this stuff in his bag and in this bag here.
guys. So in this bag, he has snacks. I know he has too many snacks. But he has snacks just in case he wants something. I know he's 13. He probably sit there and eat them all in one swoop. But I'm going to tell him not to. And he has Nutella in here as well. He doesn't care for nabs or granola bars. Because I would have put that in here. Um, the crackers and cheese. I don't know why guys. He's just so he's just so finicky. And because I was going down the island Dollar Tree. And I was like now what else would he like. And it's not too many things that he would care for. Um, so let's put his bags, I almost forgot about these, in here. So, again, he's instructed to take this bag out. Good gracious. Take this bag out and put it on top of his bag or in his other bag. Don't take this one, um, on the bus. So, if he feels like he needs to take a little bag with him on the bus and leave it on the bus, then he can take this on the bus, but take this big pouch out, take this small, middle, medium sized one out, and he should be good, good to go. So he'll have his glasses, um, something's missing, his umbrella. It's gonna rain on Friday, they told us to check the forecast, so it's 100% um, chance that it's gonna rain. So he has his wipes in here, he has his sanitizer in the front pocket, Make sure it's on tight and it wasn't. His chapstick in his front pocket and his Kleenex. And for his that Allegra, I put it in this bag because I told him it's 24 hours. So he should take it in the morning and leave it in the hotel room. So I'm going to put his snack bag in here. And I think this worked out really well. Um, he said he was curious to know what the other kids are bringing. I said the girls probably bring a whole lot of stuff. But also getting his stuff together and I don't know if you guys are like that I had two kids for a really long time and with two kids you can kind of go back and forth back and forth like like tennis <laughs> but with three it's like the ball game changes a little bit and it's like you're going in a triangle constantly triangle and you try to make sure each one has what they need and I'm glad that I knew the season was changing anyway JJ is getting larger He's going out of boy sizes to, I know I'm talking a whole lot, to men's, like the smaller size. So he needs um, t-shirts, size as two, and then um, he needs, um, he likes to wear certain clothes. So he's really picky, so I kind of ask him what he likes to wear. He likes the joggers. And I did find some ones for a good sale on Rue 21 um, right now. I think they're by buy buy one and get one for five dollars so that's a good deal so guys that's it if he wants to put a water bottle in there and or his umbrella so i need to go find that i must have left it or either i stuck it in this other bag so guys thanks so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe i hope this was helpful um i just saw those dollar tree bags and i thought it would be great to record this so, I'm not a packing pro or anything, but I do like getting their stuff together to go somewhere, and um, I hope they have fun. So, you guys have a great day or weekend or whenever you see this, and thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Bye-bye, guys. Oh, guys, the umbrella was in there. Didn't even know. I was getting ready to do a thumbnail picture, and it was at the bottom of the bag. So, this is just a Dollar Tree umbrella so I may give him another umbrella but these do work great yeah if you're careful <laughs> so they work great